guys, it's Bunny and welcome to today's video. For today, I will be reacting to Family Guys and in this one, it's most offensive moments. あなた様のお願いに従います。お父様のお願いに従います。<笑> Mom, you're Jewish? I'm sorry I never told you, dear. When we were married, your father made me conceal the fact so he could get into country clubs. It was the right thing to do. It was the right what? thing to do, dear. Oh, my God. So Grandma Hebrewberg is actually Jewish? Yes. When she moved to America, her family changed their name. It was originally Hebrewberg Money Grabber. That makes you Jewish, Lois. Shalom, Jews! What? Wow, Dad, where did you get all that glistening chest hair? It came with my Star of David. Peter, what is all this? Look, this is my way of letting you know that I'm embracing who you are. Oh, and I don't respond to Peter. From now on, I want you to use my Hebrew name. <laughs> Meg, Meg, I promise I'll do better at this job than I did on the SATs. What did he do? Oh, no. I knew Come on. It. Do math. Check I it out. It. I'm one of you guys now, huh? I'm Jewish. Yeah. Holocaust. We're number one. Look at all these short. Bruh, like, they're Jewish jokes, though. Like, they don't just do one casual joke. I feel like they did a whole episode just joking about it. Oh, cringe. So cringe. Both hairy men. God, I feel like I'm on the forest moon of Endor. Oh, look at this guy. Now there's someone who cuts his own hair. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, my <laughs> God. Oh, 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 check out this uptight Asian guy. Look at that. I work really hard because I'm no fun. Bwong. <laughs> <laughs> if I literally made one joke like this while being live on stream, I would be canceled immediately. <laughs> I haven't been this scared since Mother Teresa OD'd in my car. She is messed up, man! Shut up! Just shut up! Let me think! Push her out. We can't leave her alone. Push the bitch out! Hey, if anyone appreciates a good yoke, it's the use. <laughs> That's my Jewish laugh. I'm working on a Jewish laugh. Peter, I'm so embarrassed right now. Can we please just go? Hang on, I'll be right back, Lois. I'm just going across the street. Peter, you can't keep using Cleveland's bathroom. Oh, my God. Yes, I can. Cleveland's bathroom is the greatest discovery since fat women discovered Diet Coke. Now I can eat anything. <laughs> but, Mom, I don't really care about being Jewish. Or even Christian, for that matter. <laughs> All I'm saying is I let your father take my Jewish identity, and I've regretted it ever since. I don't know, Mom. I'll think about it. <laughs> Carter, knock it Damn. off! Come on, you know you Jew girls want that dollar. Follow the dollar and it'll lead you to... Uh, what, are, what are Jews like? Salmon! There's salmon over here! I'm entitled to these things, Lois. Especially after I got shafted so by that mean. Asian Santa at the mall. What you want? What you want for Christmas? Um, I was thinking maybe one of those old-timey... Too late! Take too long! Sad Christmas! What you want? Buy a truck! What color? Red! Next! Ah! Oh, you're a worse oh parent God. than Britney Spears. I know, I know. Oh, the gift basket was not worth the trip. Not by a long shot. Oh, I gotta get that. I'll talk to you later. Well, I am ready for my oh. evening. Oh, my God, Peter. What the hell? Peter, what are you doing? Oh, surely, Jerome, you don't want to stay in the same house as a ghost who carries a torch around. Ooh, fire ghost. Oh, you scared yet? Didn't know this place was haunted, did you? Peter, take that thing off. Hey, what the hell's going on? I'll tell you what's going on. I have had about enough of you, Jerome. I know you want my wife, but you can't have her. You are no longer welcome in my house. What you talking about, Peter? <laughs> Peter, this movie doesn't seem to make any sense. It makes perfect sense, Lois. This is the scene where our heroine, Vagina Hertz, is told by Dr. McNugget here that she has uncurable chick cancer. All right, Joe, let's lose the wheelchair and shoot this thing. Peter, I can't lose the wheelchair. I need it to move. Okay, yeah, but your character can walk. Peter, I'm handicapped. I can't walk. Okay, Chris, roll film and action. 
Joe, get out of the damn chair. Chris, get you the can't. cattle prod. Ah! Okay, now give him some peanut butter so we can make it look like he's talking. Why are they selling all those DVDs so cheap? Because, Chris, oh DVDs are outdated and obsolete, yeah. like white track stars. On your marks, get set, white guys, go! I have high hopes for this. I had a cliff bar before we started. Everybody else! <gasps> Phew, I thought what? they were coming after us. What Quagmire thing? How oh, you know, just that he hates you. Out? Quagmire hates me? Hates you. I, I don't get it. Why, why wouldn't Quagmire like me? Because he thinks you're annoying. Like people who never shut up about their kids. He... he would have been yeah, four I today. Like I, I still don't understand. How do you drown in an inch of water? <laughs> well, yeah. I guess I don't have a new sweater and a haircut. It's all right. I don't think the club will mind. It's Cleveland I'm worried about. Peter, is this really necessary? I can't hardly see anything. Hey, look, it's President Nixon. No, wait, it's a black guy. No, it's Nixon. So much? Carter, as your boss, I'm ordering you to pay a compliment to this sharply dressed Asian man. You look very nice. What else? Uh... What about my shoe? They're nice, too. How you think my house smell? Not oniony. You good, man. I pat you on the head and feed you from the hand. Huh? Drive. Um, any particular direction? That way. You're gonna help me get some money so I can get out of this town. Really? Where are you gonna go? I don't know. Somewhere far away. Maybe China. I hear they got NASCAR there now. We now return to Cutting in Line in Front of Italians. Hey! Copernicus, why don't you navigate yourself to the back of the line with your feet and stand there with your shirt? And I was wondering if maybe, um, you want to go out on a date with me? Okay, pick me up Saturday at 8. Great! See you then! There you go, being confident, like an Italian guy in any given theoretical situation. If that was me, I I'm just saying, if that was me, they are lucky that was not me. Because if the circumstances were such, as you have described them, but with me in them, that's a very different and scary outcome for those involved. Yeah. If. So from now on, everybody has a bath buddy. Huh? Hey, Meg, watch. This was such a great idea for a weekend activity. Well, I thought it'd be good to get out of the house. I don't like the kids being around that racist sunflower that's grown in our yard. Hey, boy. Don't you come walking by this house. You're ignorant. Uh, <laughs> oh, did you hear that cashier's accent? Would you like some change, please, for you? <laughs> oh, you know, if it weren't for 9-11, those guys would be adorable. No, 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 we're and not doing this. keep Mort away. Peter, what the hell is that? Lois, well, I'm tired of Mort always mooching off us, so I made a scared you. Peter, we're not going to have this in our front yard. It's racist, and for God's sake, you ruined your best suit. Just now we're going to so have to get you a new one. Shh, shh, Lois, Lois, look. Hey, guys, I just wanted to return you. Oh, oh, my God, it's Hitler. He's back. He's back. Hurry, protect John Stewart. He's our most important Jew. Oh. Yes. Well, I, I'm just going to go to the powder room and freshen up. She's eating it up? This is easier than an American finding his brother in China. Ron? Ron, where are you? Over here, Paul. Oh, good. There you are. It's pretty here. Yes, it is. <laughs> We now return to Japanese girls think small versions of things are really cute. Oh, look at my tiny dog. I'm going to put it in my so tiny purse. <laughs> tiny phone. <laughs> tiny everything. <laughs> Tom, I'm standing here with Stephen Hawking, the first white man uh -huh. I've ever met who knows math better than me. Mr. Oh Hawking, what does the discovery of this black hole mean to you and your research? I am overjoyed. This is the crowning achievement of my career. It validates the work of a lifetime. It certainly does. Back to you, Tom. All right, we're clear. I'm telling you, man, this shtick is getting so old. That chair smells, dude. Hey, Steve, oh surf's up! All right, see you, bitch. Imagine, that would be so And there's so the Vietnam cool, War Memorial. Hey, check out that Vietnamese guy giving a business to those Vietnam vets. 
Scoreboard! Scoreboard! Oh, what happened to your friend? Hey, I know that guy. I kill him. He cried like a bitch. Vietnam undefeated. Oh, uh... Come on, guys. Let's go eat in the living room. It stinks in here. Oh, no. Does it stink because I farted? Because sometimes I can suck him back up. I think we can make uh -huh. up some of these losses in the third quarter. <laughs> what was that? What was what? Oh, nothing. I thought I smelled a fart, but now I don't. And I got a job following fat people around with a tuba. Stop it! Cut it out! I have a glandular problem! That'll be $60. I'm honored oh, that you no. would ask me, Naomi. I, I'll have to think about it. I mean, this is a life-altering choice. You, you know, like an Italian choosing to get glasses. Okay, read the third row down, please. Hey, hey, yo, oh, hey, yo, oh, oh, hey! Would you like a nice cold glass? Why, sure. Lemonade. You couldn't have been here for three hours on this, the hottest day of the year, or the ice cubes in your pitcher would have melted. Oh. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say Peter, to Peter, we can't arrest them. If anything, they can arrest you. Hey, here's the tricycle. You were right, Peter. This kid's a thief. We did it. Well, look at us. You know, we make a great team, guys, like Huey Lewis and the Jews. You don't need money. Sorry, the bed's breaking up. Hey, Joe. Good morning, Peter. I'm here to revoke your driver's license. What? Why? We got reckless driving, disturbing the peace, plus the driver of one of those other cars was a virgin whose hymen was busted by the airbag, so rape. Okay, well, I guess you can take my license. Of course, it's all the way up here. Peter, knock right it here, off. Joe. Give it to right me. Here. Give me the officer. damn license. Well, don't, don't you want it? This is in yeah. poor taste, yeah. Peter. You're starting in? to piss me well, off. You do You're starting to piss right. me right. off! Ah! Drink or treat. <gasps> What in God's name are you doing? You, you can't go out dressed like that. Why not? I'm Bill Cosby. Uh, okay, yeah. but I mean, I, you, you can't go out like that. Well, oh, come on, Mom. Don't I look like him? Well, yes, but Chris, you can't just walk around in blackface. It's racist. It's racist. Now yep. go upstairs and put on That's that Indian chief costume I bought you. Oh, I don't want to. You have to. It's racist. Guys, there is literally no limit. Like, they go all out all the time. What? All right, guys, that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more.